I'm on the Grand Canal in the Peggy Guggenheim collection in Venice, and I'm here alone, and uh, they've allowed me to come and visit before the opening, and I just I had to share this with you because it's quite overwhelming being here in this space, in this palace, with all this art. And so I just want to take this opportunity, yes, there's a Pollock just hanging out, to walk around and show you this amazing place. This used to be the dining room. Severini. This is her dining room here. And as we walk through, we're now gonna enter into the kitchen. And this is the kitchen. So these are some of the most important artists uh, of the 20th century, the Chagall, the Chirico. And this is all her collection. They don't add to the collection. They just protect it, conserve it. And in the 1980s, before this actually opened to the public, they started restoring and cleaning things out because obviously this is a fair knowledge and you can see there's a piece of glass in front of it. But it wasn't protected, it was just her house. And so they had to clean all the paintings and restore them all before they could put them up. Robert de Lenné. It's quite overwhelming when you're walking through. I mean, you, uh, I'm walking through now and I don't really know where to stop or what to look at. It's quite surreal, just kind of walking across a couple of Cornell boxes and you want to sit in front of each one of these things for at least an hour, but I can't. Uh, and <laughs> here is another room. Oh my goodness. Look at that. And Jackson Pollock. And actually, I was just told that Peggy Guggenheim was the first person to give Jackson Pollock his own show uh, in New York. And so there are some of her pieces. It's it's endless. Rufino Tamayo. Francis Bacon. Oh, oh. And these were the bedrooms. And here are my friends. <laughs> Who made this all possible. And I mean, it just goes on. Rene Magritte. And I mean, it, this, this was her bedroom. That was her bedroom. But this was a bedroom. This was a bedroom. Okay. And, and the bathroom, and the Magritte, uh -huh. and, uh, oh my God, and the Salvador Dali. I feel very, very, very lucky, and I couldn't resist. I had to share this with all of you. Uh, so, I hope you enjoyed it. Ciao da Venezia. Ciao a tutti. Yeah, oh, there's one more piece. Colder, and then Picasso. Just another piece. Alexander Calder. Behind me, Picasso, <laughs> oh, mamma mia, and above us, not colder. Not colder. Uh, you, you get the idea. <laughs> it's remarkable. Ciao, ciao.